Hi, welcome to the Posthuman Installation Guide. So I've just downloaded the Posthuman library and it's in my downloads folder. Um, so it's this fm posthuman.zip file. I'm gonna go ahead and double click on it to unzip the file. The zip file takes a few minutes to expand. Once the file's unzipped, you'll see the fm posthuman folder. Feel free to copy this folder to wherever you keep your contact instruments or contact libraries. I keep my instruments on a drive called storage in a folder that I created called contact instruments. So I'll go ahead and copy the FM posthuman folder to my contact instruments folder. Inside the FM posthuman folder, you'll see a folder called posthuman that contains all of the NKI instrument files, samples, and resources for the posthuman. All right, let's go to contact and I'll show you the easiest way to navigate the instruments. You'll need the full version of contact 5.51 or higher. Posthuman will not work with the contact free player, so make sure you have a full version. So we have an empty contact here. Uh, click on the Browse button to open up the browser section of Contact, and you'll see there's tabs for files, libraries, database, etc. Click on the Files tab, that's where we'll be loading the instruments from. In the browser, navigate to the Posthuman folder and then to the Instruments folder inside of that. You'll see the 50 NKI instrument files for Posthuman appear below. Double click on one uh, and it will load. You can use the arrow buttons to go to the next patch or previous patch. Alternatively, you can drag and drop an NKI file from the contact browser directly on top of the currently loaded instrument to replace it with a, a new one. Last but not least, you can directly drag and drop an NKI file from the Mac OS Finder or from the Windows Explorer window uh, directly into contact and it will load the patch. Thanks, hope you enjoy Posthuman.